Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Kids Cartoon Bonanza. Today is going to be very active because we are learning about our amazing bodies. From the top of your head to the tips of your toes, you have so many special parts that help you move, see, and play. I am going to show you 30 body parts. Can you find them on your own body while we learn? Let's get moving. Number one is the head. This is the very top part of your body. Your head is very important because it holds your brain inside. It allows you to nod yes or shake no. Can you touch the top of your head? Number two is hair. Most people have hair covering the top of their heads. It keeps our heads warm and comes in many beautiful colors like black, brown, blonde, or red. Say it with me, hair. Number three is the forehead. This is the smooth part of your face right above your eyes and below your hair. When you are thinking really hard, sometimes you wrinkle your forehead. Can you say forehead? Number four are the eyes. We use our eyes to see the world around us. You can see colors, shapes, and your friends. We have eyelids that close to let us sleep. Blink your eyes. Number five are the eyebrows. These are the little lines of hair right above your eyes. They help keep sweat out of your eyes and they help you show feelings, like when you are surprised. Say it with me, eyebrows. Number six are the ears. You have one ear on each side of your head. Ears are for listening. They let you hear music, birds singing, and your parents calling your name. Can you touch your ears? Number seven is the nose. Your nose is right in the middle of your face. We use it to smell flowers or yummy food cooking. It also helps us breathe air in and out. Can you wiggle your nose? Number eight are the cheeks. These are the soft parts on the sides of your face under your eyes. When you smile, your cheeks go up, and sometimes they turn red when you are shy. Say it with me, cheeks. Number nine is the mouth. We use our mouth to speak, sing, and eat delicious food. When you are happy, you use your mouth to give a big smile. Can you say mouth? Number 10 are the teeth. Inside your mouth are your hard white teeth. We use them to chew up our food so we can swallow it. Remember to brush them every day. Say it with me, teeth. Number 11 is the tongue. Your tongue helps you move food around in your mouth and it helps you talk. It is also how we taste things like sweet ice cream or sour lemons. Can you say tongue? Number 12 is the chin. This is the bony point at the very bottom of your face, under your mouth. It moves up and down when you are talking. Can you touch your chin? Number 13 is the neck. Your neck connects your head to the rest of your body. It lets you turn your head from side to side to look both ways before crossing the street. Say it with me, neck. Number 14 are the shoulders. Your shoulders are at the top of your arms. We use them to carry a backpack. If you don't know the answer to a question, you might shrug your shoulders. Can you say shoulders? Number 15 is the chest. This is the front part of your body between your neck and your stomach. Inside your chest are your lungs, which fill up with air when you take a deep breath. Say it with me, chest. Number 17 is the stomach. Sometimes we call this our belly. When you eat lunch, the food goes down into your stomach. If you are hungry, your stomach might make a growling sound. Can you rub your stomach? Number 18 is the back. This is the part of your body that you can't see. It is behind you. Your back is strong and helps you stand up straight and tall. Say it with me, back. Number 19 is the arm. You have two long arms 
They help you lift things, hug your family, and swing on the monkey bars at the playground. Can you wave your arm? Number 20 is the elbow. The elbow is the hard, pointy part in the middle of your arm. It's like a hinge that lets your arm bend so you can touch your face. Can you say, elbow? Number 21 is the hand. At the end of your arms are your hands. We use hands to clap, draw pictures, catch a ball, and hold things. Say it with me, hand. Number 22 are the fingers. You have five fingers on each hand. They are great for tickling and for counting to 10. Can you wiggle your fingers? Number 23 is the leg. Your legs are long and strong. They hold your body up. We use our legs to walk, run, jump, and dance. Can you pat your leg? Number 24 is the knee. Just like your elbow bends your arm, your knee bends your leg. You need to bend your knees to sit down or to jump really high. Can you touch your knee? Number 25 is the ankle. The ankle connects your leg to your foot. It is a bony joint that lets you move your foot up and down or spin it in a circle. Say it with me, ankle. Number 26 is the foot. You stand on your feet. They help you balance so you don't fall over. We put socks and shoes on our feet to keep them safe. Can you stomp your foot? Number 27 are the toes. At the end of your feet are your toes. You have five on each foot, just like your fingers. Wiggling your toes in the sand or grass feels funny. Can you say toes? Number 28 is the brain. Now for a few parts inside you. The brain is inside your head. It's like a computer that controls your whole body and helps you think and learn. Say it with me, brain. Number 29 is the heart. Your heart is inside your chest on the left side. It beats all day and night, thump, 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 to pump blood around your body. Say it with me, heart. Number 30 are bones. You can't see them, but your body is full of hard bones. They fit together to make a skeleton that gives your body its shape and keeps it strong. Say it with me, bones. Wow, what a great workout. You learned 30 different parts of your body. You are amazing from head to toe. Thanks for moving and learning with Kids Cartoon Bonanza. Make sure to subscribe so we can have more fun next time. Bye-bye.